My name's Mike, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how this device could effectively take over the world. Now, my background is in cybersecurity, so we used to carry out what's called a penetration test. So we would get engaged by governments and companies, very large organizations, to test their infrastructure. Now, a lot of people think that you need huge amounts of computing power to do that, but in reality, most penetration tests that I carried out would use a mobile phone, shout out to Desploit, HDMI interceptors that would intercept your screen and show a hacker exactly what you're doing, or just USB sticks. So with these USB sticks alone, you could carry out almost an entire penetration test. Getting access into computers, servers, and infrastructure, um, but also key login and deauthenticating systems as well. But those days are gone. And now all of that plus more can be done with this device. But what can this device actually do? Well, number one, it can hack car keys, even modern day car keys with rolling key encryption. It can hack hotel keys and smart locks. It can disconnect, hack and jam Wi-Fi. So if you're using Wi-Fi, this can not only disconnect your device, but it can stop you reconnecting as well. It can hack Bluetooth, so it can intercept AirPods and Bluetooth devices, hack gym fobs and access cards in a range of different places. It can open and jam gates and security secure access control, so barriers, anything that's used for access control into car parks or secure areas, etc. It can hack infrared, so here it's got an infrared transceiver. People think infrared's dying, but in reality, air conditioning, TV, a lot of stuff still uses infrared technology. And it can be a bad USB. In fact, it can be multiple bad USBs. So rather than needing three, four, five different USB sticks to carry out a job, now you can use just one. And it can also hack your bank cards and magnetic strips. No longer do you need to use multiple tools. Now you just need this one. So if you're out and you see this device, the best thing to do is probably stay as far away as possible. So if you found this interesting, don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss an upload.